Food Network's Daisy Martinez has this Mexican wedding cookie recipe that she calls Johnny's Impossibly Tawdry Mexican Wedding Cookie. Okay, the name alone, I simply had to give it a try. And then I took on the challenge of making that cookie into a cocktail. What I came up with was something I call the wedding dress. I start by adding one egg white into a shaker. Now we're gonna wanna shake this for a pretty considerable amount of time, like three, four, maybe even five minutes, because we want it to get really, really frothy. The frothiness is gonna make our cocktail really silky and smooth. On top of that, it's going to let our garnish float. All right? It's been about five minutes. I think these are pretty frothy. And I'm gonna take a pint glass, and in the pint glass, I'm gonna put a scoop of ice and two ounces of silver tequila. What I like about silver tequila is it's neutral flavor. That way, when I add all my other elements, it's not gonna overwhelm the cocktail. Now I'm gonna add about a half an ounce of fresh squeezed lemon juice. Half a lemon yields about a half an ounce. And I have a cheesecloth over this so that if there's any seeds in the lemon, they won't get into my cocktail. I'm gonna squeeze that in. All right, then I'm gonna add a splash of hazelnut liqueur. That's gonna give this cocktail a really lovely nutty twist that a Mexican wedding cookie has. Then to sweeten it up a little bit, some agave nectar. Agave hails from Mexico, it comes from a cactus plant. Now if you can't find agave, you can replace it with a little maple syrup or even some honey for the same effect. All right, I'm gonna stir this up. Now I'm gonna add this to our really frothy egg whites. Right. Just dump that in, put the top on, and give it another good shake. All right, then I'm gonna take the lid off. I'm gonna pour it into my martini glass. Look at how nice and frothy that is. And the frothiness is going to keep our garnish afloat. Now, if you want to omit the egg whites, you can do that. Of course, it's not going to have a nice frothiness, but what I would suggest is rimming the glass with some crushed walnuts instead. But in this case, we're going to take these walnuts and we're going to float them right on top of our cocktail. All right, it's time to try this wedding dress on. Mmm. Wow. The tequila, the lemon juice, a little splash of hazelnut, a little bit of agave and the toasted walnuts on top. This is like a nutty margarita. Salud.